<laughs> I'm waiting for the thing to focus. Oh, there you go. Hi, you guys. So, I wanted to come on here and I wanted to talk about my new adventure. Sorry, no makeup today. I think that I look better without makeup. I have really oily skin and I'm not good at applying makeup anyways. But I wanted to come through and show my hair. And I did wash the hair. And this is how it looks. Um, I actually perm rod it last night. So I had curls earlier, but they fell. But the hair is really nice. It washed really nice. Um, I can still run my fingers through it. The hair sheds a little bit, but not too much. And I know that it's shedding because I um I cut the wefts when I got like to hair. So yes, um my business name is DKS Essentials You could go to that website to purchase your hair. Um, I also have other beauty accessories on there as well. As my business grows, so will the um, items that you will be able to purchase. Now, a little bit about myself, which I haven't gotten a chance to come on here and talk about myself at all. But a little um, back history on myself. I am a licensed cosmetologist. I've had my license for about six to seven years. <clears throat> excuse me um i have been doing hair before six to seven years um been doing hair since i was about i'll say 14 15 started out with a friend's hair shout out going to joy joy um helped me to learn how to um do micro braiding a friend of mine's Back home in the Caribbean. If you guys don't know, I'm from the Caribbean. St. Kitts. Oh, yeah. Um, and she taught me how to do a lot of my braiding. Um, my aunt braided hair as well. And I used to sit and watch her do it in the backyards on the weekends. But Joy really got me into um, braiding hair more. Another shout out go to one of my old friends that I met when I was 13, Shatara. She helped me to um, learn how to do weaving and stuff like that. So shout out go to her. Um, I have no um, issues with giving shout outs to people when it's due. So yeah, um, when I was growing up, I used to do people's hair for extra money, you know, working on the side. And um People will always say, oh, you should do hair. You should go to school for doing hair. But I actually wanted to go to school to be a dentist. I remember telling one of my old friends, oh, I'm going to be a dentist. And he was like, no, you're not. <laughs> and I was so mad at him for saying that. But I guess it was true. I'm not a dentist. I am still assisting people and helping them. Um, but I'm just not one. I'm not one because I got a really good opportunity from someone at my church. Um, she was the dentist and she allowed me to come and work under her and see how it is to, you know, do that type of work. And I decided that that type of work was not for me. So um, I just decided that I was going to pursue something that I'm good at. And even though I didn't want to get my hair um, licensed and to do hair, I'm actually really good at it. And so I'm glad that... Um, I'm glad that I actually pursued it because it's something that I love. Like when I'm doing hair and it's and, and I can see the outcome and it's coming out really good, I get really excited, you guys. Like so excited, like goosebumps. I get goosebumps on my, you know, when the hairstyle that I'm doing is coming out right. And that just shows that I love what I do. So I decided to take this adventure with buying um hair and purchasing hair and selling it um, because I do hair and a lot of time my clients, uh, especially new clients, they always say, do you have hair? And I don't, I, I always, I'll s tell them where I think have the best hair and I'll send them there, but it's like, why am I giving my money away? 
So I decided to sell hair. I think it's the best thing that I could have done. Um, the hair business is going really well right now. Um, I'm going to expand it to more things once it, things start rolling a little bit better. Um, I've only been doing this for about the hair, selling the hair for, I can say, maybe about a month or two. Um, and it's going pretty good. I'm gaining knowledge of different things. I'm meeting new people. I've lost friends, unfortunately. That sounds crazy, right? Yep, but I've lost friends uh, pursuing my dream. But I guess I can say that, that pers these people weren't really my friends. Because if you're really my friend, you would be happy for me to pursue my dream, right? But, you know, it's okay. We live and we learn and we move forward. And I am going to move forward from here and I'm going to take my experiences that I've learned and just continue to do better. So I just wanted to come out here and um, just let you guys have a Q&A with me. Anything that you want to ask, don't hesitate to ask me. I will definitely answer the um, whatever question that you have. I have nothing to hide. Um, I don't have any children, so the, if you see any kids on my, um, on my, uh, channel, it might just be nieces and nephews. I don't have any children. Yes, I was married. I was married for about 10 years. I've known my ex-husband for about 17, 18 years, but we were married for about 10 years. Um, the marriage is over, um, which I'm not at all mad at because, it was very tumultuous, and I'm glad that it's over. But, um, yes, I'm so happy to start this new journey, and I want to take you guys along with me. Like I said, don't hesitate to um, ask me. I'm running out of space on my camera, but I just want to show the back of the hair after I washed it. It's doing pretty good, I must say, uh, and it's really, really soft. I didn't think it would be as soft as it is, as it is. But it's really soft after washing it. It's definitely not like washing store-bought hair. Um, when you wash store-bought hair, it tangles. It doesn't react the way this. This reacts really, really well, I must say. Um, I'm going to put in a little snippet of things that I've done. I've, I've, I make wigs, you guys. I do braiding, weaving. I specialize in um, the health of natural hair. My hair is natural right now. It's just I pressed it with a hot comb so that it could blend in. Um, don't even think about asking me to show my natural hair. I don't like it. I think that it's so fine, you know. I'm working on the health of that at the moment. But um, I just wanted to come through and just show you guys the hair. Like the hair is, the hair is everything, you know. Um, I burnt myself with the hot comb. <laughs> but yes, the hair is everything. It 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 lays right, you know. It blends in really good with my own hair, my natural hair. Um, yes, I do have grays, and no, I don't. I'm not going to. Um, dye them because dye really dries my hair out and I'm really working on the health of my hair and if I have to be gray with healthy hair that's just the way it's gonna be and you gotta accept it for me for who I am right that's how God made me I've been graying since I was about I'll say 18 is when I had my first gray hair but it's okay it runs in the family you know I know where I'm from I know my history and so um Yes, so um, if you guys want to ask me any questions, um, I'm new to YouTube. I haven't quite, when I first started this page, I haven't quite decided what I wanted to do. Like if you look at my past videos, you'll see that um, I'm doing like random stuff, showing apartment tours. I mean, that's stuff that I like to do. I like to decorate and things like that, but I definitely have to get into that more. Um, I'm trying to hurry up and talk because I don't have that much time left, but, um, my thing is hair and that's what I do. That's what I'm good at. Um, I'm going to show tutorials on me doing hair and everything like that. And I hope that you guys, in, uh, um, enjoy my videos. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to your girl. Um, and I guess I'll talk to you later.